Sticks and stones. I've learned over the years through a childhood rhyme about sticks and stones that a broken bone merits more worry than a broken mind. And all the while I wondered why. Why are we more concerned with something that can heal in a few months than something that can take years to repair? Why'd you dye your hair? How much did that hair cost? What did you eat last? Shouldn't you have spent the money on food? People who would always tease me for being the skinny kid, but the problem is I didn't like being skinny. Skinny seems to be this image we put on a pedestal, but more often than not, I'm uncomfortable sitting up on that pedestal. I can't express my unhappiness and being there without being brushed off, without being told I can't be unhappy with my body because I'm skinny. I can't express that every single day I feel like I'm more stick than stone, like if I tried to laugh out, I'd snap in half. I love your hair. It's pretty. I love how its colors intertwine like a rainbow grapevine. I love the way your waist goes in my arms. It's beautiful. I once met a boy who complimented me whenever he caught a glance at me. He made me feel like I was amazing, like I was deserving of everything in the world and I never needed to worry about anything. He made me feel like the galaxy was something we could swim around in whenever we wanted to, like it was just a deep pool full of glittering lights waiting for us to cannonball in. Whenever we talked, he would make me feel like I was deserving of listening to, and not a voice that could be brushed off. When we talked, I felt special, but we haven't talked in months, and all I have left is myself, and that's not the best person to leave me alone with. I end up tearing myself apart, cutting myself off, cutting myself open in a frantic attempt to empty myself so I would feel no more pain. Don't try and tell me that hurts less than a broken bone. <laughs> 